A food establishment is gaining more attention as they get good feedback on their pork dishes. To know more about their specialties, we have Janina Chan with this report. These days, when it comes to restaurants, it's usually the uniqueness of the establishment that lures people to enter and dine. It, it was inspired by the son's owner, Rico. He is uh, seven years old and then he came up with the word flying pig. Just the name itself is catchy already. But it's not just the surroundings that the customers repeatedly come back for. It's a French-American bistro with, uh, with a twist of uh, also a Filipino and uh, some Mediterranean. Also. Our specialties are uh, smoked chicken, pork, baby back ribs, and uh, we also have the smoked cochinillo and then uh, frying cochifito as uh, best sellers. For the dessert, we have uh, cakes for dessert. So we have a uh, dream cake and a uh, cheesecake. We will be launching our breakfast meal. We'll be serving uh, smoked bangus and then the, uh, our homemade sardines we have. And then uh, some of the barbecue dishes like the, the pork barbecue and the smoked chicken will be there. But it's with garlic rice and egg. And then we also have the pork adobo, which is also our best seller. And then we have sausages and uh, vegan longanisa. So we'll be served with the uh, fruit, fruits and um, coffee. That's a really happy meal. Yeah. The interior bursts with colors and quirky flying pig portraits while maintaining a clean overall ambiance. People of all ages will definitely have fun in this innovative setting, especially the kids. And now with their new edition of breakfast meals, there is more to look out for. So feed your tummy right with all these mouth-watering dishes in this one-of-a-kind restaurant. This is Jingyan Chan reporting for RPN's Team Watch.